Hello. 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 Oh, hi, I believe I'm speaking with Mr. Yes, that's right, yes. Uh, good afternoon to you, Mr. It has been a long time to speak to you. My name is Chris, how are you doing? I'm alright, thank you. Why has it been a long time? <laughs> because I'm calling you from Domestic Appliance Premium Protect in regards to your hot point washing machine. Oh. I'm calling you, yeah, I'm calling you because the service plan that was protecting your hot point washing machine for the repair has expired. So we have been instructed to call you by the manufacturer to oh. get that updated and keep you fully protected. I see. Yeah, now the first and the foremost is the machine still in good working order at the moment. Uh, my washing machine is, yes. Yeah. Lovely. Now the yes, so, so who told you to ring me? Sorry, I didn't catch that. The manufacturer, the hot point. The hot point. Yep. Yep. Right. And the new paperwork will be with you in the next three to five days in your address, which is with the postcode. Right? Yes, yeah, so what you've got there? Lovely. Now your new policy still includes all parts of labor, no hidden fee. If we can't fix your appliance, as you are aware, we will simply replace it. With a brand new upgraded version of your current machine on the same. Oh, all oh right, good. Now, Mr. The main reason I'm calling you because we would like to offer you a discount just to make it a bit cheaper for you this time. We have two options for you. Let me know which one suits your best. Your usual one-year plan has been reduced down to just 89 pounds for the whole year. However, like myself, you want to save some money. I will recommend you for the three-year plan, as you pay for the two-year and get the third year free. For 195 pounds. So shall we go ahead with this plan or should I stick to your usual one year plan? Oh, I'm not sure what I've got at the moment. Like you can go ahead for the usual one year plan or else if you want to save some money, you can go ahead for the three year plan as you pay for the two year and get the third year free for 195 pounds. Oh, it's a lot of money there, don't you think? If you will calculate by yourself, sir, 89 pounds is for one year. If you will calculate by three, it's uh, if you will calculate by yourself, 89 into 3, it will be around 267 pounds. But if you will cover, if you will take a cover all together for two years, you don't have to pay 267 pounds. You can pay only 195 pounds, and you will be getting the third year free. Oh, that all sounds very complicated. The, so you can go ahead for the one year plan then. How it sounds to you? You want to go for the one-year plan then? If three-year plan is complicated... Yes, terribly complicated. I, I can't follow it at all. All right, then you want to go for the one-year plan, right? Just for the one-year, right? Right, sir? For what, sorry? You want to go ahead just for the one-year plan, right? One Do year, I? Pounds. Oh, I'm not sure, really. All right, so should I go ahead just for the one-year plan? If you if you if you want to go ahead and right. have that. All right. Now this gives you unlimited protection for the next one year. Just need to I just need to confirm some details to make sure the paperwork sent to the correct address, which is right. Uh, no, no, that's not right, actually. Can you please help me out with your postcode, please? Oh, uh, well, I, d I don't really feel comfortable about giving out that information on the phone. <laughs> Sir, I'm not asking for you any account number or short code. I'm just confirming the postcode so that we can send you the paperwork. Oh, I'm very so forgetful. I'm very forgetful. I'm going to have to find something where, where, where it's written down. So it's not... No. No, I don't know where you got that information from. Yes. So can you please confirm me your address so that we can send you the paperwork? Oh. Well, surely you must have the information there. You're like, you don't have a hot point washing machine? What? You don't have hot point washing machine? Don't I? You do have hot point or not? I've got a washing machine, yes. Yes. So should I go ahead and cover your washing machine? What are you going to cover it with? For your washing machine. Oh, right. So could you please help me out with your postcode, please? Uh, I'm going to have to find an envelope or something with it on. Uh, I, I'm not sure, not sure what, what, what it is. I can hold the line for you. Can you please check in your paperwork? Uh, yeah, yes, I, I'm sure I've got something here somewhere. Yeah, take your time. Yes, thank you. So what is the postcode? Well, I haven't found it yet. Oh, take your time. Yeah, there's, there's got to be some... Something here. Yeah. 
Yeah, just. Uh, can't seem to find anything at the moment. All right, can I call you back? Can, can I call you back after ten minutes? Will that be fine? Well, I, I don't know whether I, whether I'll have found it by then. You can. I I make sure. I I, I try it. Like uh, I guess you will find it. I guess you will find it. You can. Try well, it I might I might not find it. Sorry. I might not find it. That not an issue. I'll try my luck tomorrow then. All right. Uh, well, I don't know where it is really. So you don't know your routine. What is your postcode? Uh, you well, know. you know, you, well, you know, it's not something I, I, I tend to tend to ha have really. No, that's not right at all. So can you please confirm me the right one? Well, I, I'm sure you just have to find it on, on envelope or something. I, I don't remember that sort of thing. Thank you, thank you for being very patient. Oh, where can it be? Oh. Benji, have you got it? Oh, is that it? Oh, where can it be? Well, I don't know. Ah, uh, oh, there we are. Yes, it's, uh, it's... Sorry, sorry? Yeah? Right? Yes, that's right, yes. All right, so it's... Right? Yes, that's right, yes. What would be your house number? Oh, my house number? Yeah, just the, you just tell me the house number. The rest of the address, I will find out for you. Right, it's uh, 24 Pear Tree Road. Just hold on for a second. You said the house number is 24, right? Yes. Just hold on for a second. Let me find the exact address for you in my system. It's a... Uh, And the house number you said is number 24, right? Yes, it's 26 Pear Tree Road. It is a new, it's only just been built. It's a new new, uh, new um, place. It's uh, 26, you said house number 26, right? Yes, Pear Tree Road, yes. All right. So it's a house number 26, all right. And uh, I, I believe you are willing to go ahead just for the one year plan, right? Well, you're willing, yeah, I'm sure, you, 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 what, sorry? For the one-year plan, like if you want to go for the two-year maintenance cover or for the one-year maintenance cover? Um, no, no, yes, yes. Just for the one-year, right? Uh-huh. Should I go ahead for the one-year? Uh. Yes? Yes. All right. Now, this gives you unlimited protection for the next one year at a discounted rate of only 89 pounds, which will be activated from today itself. I have your first name, and your last name is Jim, right? Yes, yes. All right. Is it how the name appears on your card, or it's or it's? Uh. And what's the make of your card? Is it a Visa card or a Master card? Uh, it's a, it's a visa card. Visa card. Answer, you said your house number is 26? 26, no, 24. 24? Yes. Uh, uh, 24 after that? Pear tree. P-E-R, P-E-A-R-T-R-E-E. -E. Uh, could you please go slow if you don't mind, please, please? Could you please go slow? Right. Yeah, it's P, e after that? E. Uh-huh. A. Uh-huh. R. Uh-huh. T. Uh-huh. R. Uh-huh. E. E. R. O. A. D. Yes. All right. So it's Pier 3 Road. House number 24, Pier 3 Road. Right? No, 26. 26. 
Yes. Uh, first, first you said 26, then you were saying 24. Are you sure it's 26? Yes. All right, let me check in my system. Let me check. It's 26. All right. And uh, you said it's a Visa card, right? Yes. Yes. That's right, right, yes. Well, I'm sure you've got those details there from my last plan. Well, I just have the visa card, that's it. Just the visa card, written over the visa card. Oh. Please get hold of your card. I need to confirm the expiry month and the expiry year. Oh, do you not have that information there? Why? We don't store the banking details in our system because it is your personal information. Oh, store it. oh it's my personal information. Yes. Yes. We right. are authorized to store the banking details in our system for your right. security. Oh, for real right. good. For my security. Can yes, that's good. Yes. Can you please get hold of your car? I need to confirm the expiry month and the expiry year. Uh, yes, it's, uh, it's, uh, let me see. Um, it's, um, it's, um, uh, 06. Yes. 21. It's a Visa card or a MasterCard? It's a Visa card. Visa card. Can you see uh, the card is in your hand? Yes. All right. Sir, at the face of the card, at the front side of the card, you will see the long 16-digit number is starting with 4. So just read out the number starting with 4. It's uh, 4. Yeah, 4. Yes, it begins with 4. That's right, yes. Yeah, after that? Oh, you want the other number? Yeah, let's see. Whole, whole 16 number. Oh. Whole set of numbers. All right. Numbers, yes. All right. Have you got a pen or something? Yes, you can go ahead. Right, it's four nine two one. Yeah. Eight one five three. Sorry, eight one five three. Yes. Yeah, after that. Three two four zero. Yeah, after that. Two five one nine. All right. I'm repeating the card number for you once again. Please do correct me if I'm wrong. All right. Right. The new, uh, the long reference number is four nine two. One, eight one five three, three two four zero, two five one nine. Right. Right. Yes. Lovely. And just flip your card at the back side of your card, the last three digit number. Just flip your card at the back side of your card. Right. Yeah. Just flip your card at the back side of your card. The back side. Digit. Yes. Help me out. That's what I'm talking. Yeah. Two. Yes. Yeah. Just give me the last three-digit number. Oh, well, oh, that, that, that's very yeah, small. The of your card. Very yeah, small, the very small print, you know. Sorry? It's very small print. Yeah, you can, uh, you can take your time, just put your right. glasses on. Or yes, some light. let me have a look. Uh, yes, it's uh, 325. It's 325, right? Yes. All right, I'm repeating the card number once again. It's a... Uh, the expiry month and the expiry year, as you said, it's a uh, six twenty one. Yes. Uh, long sixteen num number. You said four nine two one. Yes. Eight one five three. Yes. Three two four zero. Yes. Two five one eight. Right. No, two five one nine. Two five one nine. Lovely. And the expiry month and the expiry uh, is the last three digit number at the back side of your card is three two five. Right. Yes, what I've got here. Lovely. And uh, right now, is it possible for you to get a pen and a piece of a paper? Uh, yes. Yes, I've I got one here. I can give you our helpline number. Oh, I right. give you our helpline number. Yes. Yes. Yeah, our helpline number. Yes. The, our helpline number is zero double three. Zero double three, yes. Three double zero. Three double zero. Nine zero eight four five. Yes, I'm repeating the number once again. All right, it's a zero double three three double zero nine yes. zero eight four five. All right. Right. And what's your name? It's Chris. C H R I S. Chris. Right. All right. I see. I'm sorry, as you gave me the card number four nine two one, can you please tell me which bank card it is? Like uh, Barclays, Lloyd's, Halifax, or which card is it? It's Lloyd's Bank. Lloyd's Bank, lovely. And uh, the last but not the least, can you please help me out with the make of your washing machine? Well, it's Hot Point, you said so. 
Yeah, I have in my system, it's hot point, right? That's what you have in your system. Yes, and I believe it's white in color. Well, they generally are. It's white in color, like, like it, basically in few times you will see silver color as well. Sometimes you will see black color. Well, as you, you, I, I expect you must have those details there. Yeah, I have. It's a white in color. I'm just confirming because, you know, I don't want to do any mistake from my end, you know? Right. All yes. right? Yeah, yeah. So what I'll do right now, sir, like, uh, you know, we need to send you the paperwork and I don't want to do any mistake from my end. So like, let me confirm, like, the postcode once again in my system, as you said, is... Right? Yes. And you said your address, you said it's a 26 Pier 3 road, is it right? Yes, right, yes. It's Pier 3 Creekdale Road, South Kearney, right? Sorry? It's Pier 3 with a post... Right? Yes. And what would be the county, the state? Like there is county, state or city? Well, it's, it's Swansea. It's Swansea? Yes. I got it. And what would be the city? That's Swansea. Let me check. Alright. So it's only 20... Uh, the postcode is... 26 PA3 Road, Swansea, right? Yes. Well, you must... Yes. Lovely. Yes. Lovely. Lovely. And just a silly question, this card is registered to your address and by your name, right? Hmm. Uh, can you please check how does the name appear on your card? Is yeah. or... Yes. Right? Yes. Lovely. So in summary, I'm doing a short recap once again. You will be covered for all repairs, the call-out fees, the replacement. You will be covered for that. But the only thing that you are not covered for is malicious or intentional damage. The intention, right? Intentional damage. But I'm sure you are not going to do that, right? Well, I might do. You know, if it didn't work, I might kick it. So you might kick it? You never know. I'm, I'm saying, sir, like, uh, you, the only thing that you will be not covered for is malicious. Oh. Intentional damage. Right? Oh, well, that's a shame. Well, I'm not sure I want it now. And uh, you will be receiving all the paperwork in the next three to five days, which oh. will include a plan number, terms and conditions, and all contact information, all right? Well, uh, I'm not sure I want it now. If it doesn't cover me kicking it. <laughs> Sir, it, like, if you will kick your washing machine, definitely you might your washing machine will face the trouble because no one wants to hurt their own, you know, articles. No one wants to lose their own things, right? Right. Like if I have my car, like I have my car, I have a car, definitely I won't, like, you know, I don't, I won't beat my car with a stone because, you know, if I will beat my car with a stone, definitely I will lose something. I will be, I need to pay for that. So why I will do that? Right. Yes, but you haven't got special the special cover that you're, you're that you're selling for the washing machine. No. Yeah, on your car, on your car. Why? I do. Have I mean, there's a lot of rinsing going on, obviously. <laughs> so, sir, let me tell you the last thing, just to make you aware. What? The policy price is eighty nine pounds for the entire what? one year. Yeah. Right? What, what What if I uh, What if I put some some honey in the washing machine? Would that be covered? That is your lookout. What it doesn't matter what you're putting. You want to put some honey, you want to put some water, you want to put some milk, you can put that. But the only thing that you are not covered for is malicious or... Yes, but, but you know what insurance companies are like. They might say that I put the, put the honey in the, in the detergent dispenser. They might say, say I put that in deli uh, deliberately, you know, maliciously. We, we don't cover that. We don't cover you that. You don't cover that. Oh, uh, I, I'm really not sure I want this this cover then. It doesn't seem to cover anything um, that uh, is a normal part of my household routine. You want to destroy your washing machine by your own hand? Well, uh, yes, if, uh, you know, because, you know, I have the peace of mind of knowing that your uh, your um, cover will, will, will cover it for all repairs. Thank you so much for your time, sir. Hello? 
Hello? Yeah, hi, this is Sam here. I'm the floor supervisor. Oh. Can I help you? Right. Yeah. You're f supervising the floor. Yeah, so. Um, I How, how's that spelled? Is it uh, F L O O R or F L A W? Which one you want to say? W what spelling? Yes. My name is Sam. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So, uh, what what spelling you want? When you said you're floor supervisor. No, no yeah, I'm as, I, I couldn't get you. What, what you right. were saying. Yes. So we will go ahead and extend the maintenance cover for the next 12 months, starting today, until 2021, for your hot point, six years old hot point washing machine. Is that oh. right? Well, I, I expect you'll do that, yes. Yeah, so you will receive all the paperwork at the same address, number no, that's not my address. I've been through that with your with your colleague, Chris. I've been through all that and that you still got the same old details. Twenty six Pear Tree Twenty six Pear Tree Road, Swansea, right? Yes. Yes. Yes, in the heart of England. Sir, you will receive Yes? Minute. What? Please just one more call you will receive in some time. For the final verification, wherein you just need to say that you have agreed for the maintenance cover, so that we make sure that it's a genuine call and everything is recorded for future verification. Oh, do you think there's a risk it might not be a genuine call? Because they, you know there are a lot of uh, shysters and fraudsters around uh, who, who phone people up. So are you saying this this itself might not be a genuine call? Well, I'm blowed. So that's why there is a lot of noise around. Oh, right. yes. We are, we are speaking to several customers. Yes. Day in, day out. Yes. Right? Yes. Yes, indeed. I'm sure you are. Yes, I'm sure you are. Phoning many people. No, no, not. Day in and day out. So, what do you want me to do? What? Tell me if I can help you. No, uh, what? So, we will send you uh, send out all the paperwork, yeah? And it will contain the plan number, the terms well, and conditions and all the contact information in it, all right? Well, I, I can't stop you doing that. So, um, yeah, so, so for future reference, what I would like to say, you have our phone number. Anytime you have any slightest of the problem, please feel free to give us a call so that we can schedule an on-site engineer within 24 hours time. And as, well, we, as we mentioned, yes. if in case the washing machine is broken down, Yes. We will get it replaced with a brand new, upgraded version on the same day. Uh, well, yes, but uh, your your colleague Chris said, said that, that that wouldn't happen if I damaged it myself. Yeah, this is for maintenance cover for any technical issues you face with the washing machine. Yes. Right. Yes, but uh, I mean, it could like you know it could cause a, a, a an issue. You know, if uh, you know, if I put it on casters and write uh, write it down down the hill, like like, like the Hovis advert, then uh, then you know, you probably wouldn't uh, pay for that when I crashed into a lamppost. I shouldn't think. No, no, no. See, when I say the maintenance cover, that takes care of. But it just needs a bit of maintenance. The fact is, it's got a big dent in it from the lamppost. I will explain and the water main that uh, I hit, that uh, you know, the hydrant that uh, you know, there's flooding everywhere. Yeah. Okay, sir. One more time, I would like to tell you, sir, you will receive one more final verification call. Okay, within next half an hour. Please be around the phone so that you can receive the call and don't miss the what, call. What the, what, what's your company name? It's Premier Protect 365 Domestic Appliance. Oh right. That's a very long company name. Yeah, you will receive one more call, which is a final verification call in some time. Oh, right, in some time, yes. And just say yes to it, yeah? Okay. Oh, I just... Thank you so what? Much. Yep, thank you so much, sir. You have a lovely time ahead. Bye-bye. Oh.
Hello? Uh, hi, I believe I'm speaking right? Yes. Hi sir, this is Chris once again. Do you remember the few minutes ago I spoke to you? Uh, did we? Yeah. So sir, actually within the next 5 to 10 minutes my verification team will contact you. Oh. The, all the paperwork that will be free of error, alright? Right. Alright, thank you. Hello? Howdy, good afternoon. Am I speaking to you, Mr. Yeah? Yes. Hello there, this is Alan here. I'm calling you back from the payment and verification department at Premier Protect. And I do believe they spoke to one of my colleagues just earlier about the car on your washing machine. Yeah? Uh, yes, I spoke to you. Wonderful. Yes. Now first, just to let you know that all calls are recorded. Yes, all calls are recorded. As a matter of course, yes. Of course they are, yes. Uh, yes. Perfect. Also, when it comes to paperwork, it will be allocated to 26 uh, Petri Road. Your postcode is... Yeah? Mm. Mm hmm And also your cover, it will be at a discounted rate of £89. It will be at a one-off payment, and it will be payable by your Lloyd's Visa debit card that you confirmed to my colleague earlier, correct? Huh? Okay. Now, I want you now to have your bank card handy. I will reconfirm to you the last four numbers on the card, okay? Right. Now for the long number, the last four should be 2519, yeah? Uh, yeah, I expect so. Mm -hmm. And what is the expiry date? Well, you, you'll have those details there from your colleague. On my system, uh, but we just need to make sure that the details I've got here on my system are correct. Oh. Because we would present the payment to your bank. We don't right. need to any issues with the bank later. Oh. So I just need to reconfirm the expiry date on the card. Can you reconfirm it to me? Oh. Well, you must have that information there. I mean, it just, just doesn't make any sense.
Hello, yes. Okay, have you grabbed your bank card? Uh, well, I've got it here somewhere. I think Benji, my spaniel may have gone off it. Benji, Benji, give it back. Give it back. Thank you. Yes, yes, I've got it now. So what is the expiry date? The expiry date? Mm -hmm. Well, what have you got there? It should be 0621. That's, that's what I've got here. Wonderful. And the last three numbers in the back should be 325. Uh-huh. Yeah, it should be. Yeah. Hmm. Now, just bear with me. Okay, now can you just verify to me your full name, please? Uh, well, you've got those details there. Sorry? You must have those details there. Of course we do have the details. So I yes. This is the verification call. So our job is to make sure that the details are correct. Oh. To avoid any issue with the bank later. Or even right, later. yes. So what is your full name? Well, you've got those details there. Yeah, it should be Mr. Yeah. Mm. Okay, so just bear with me. Okay, so as you know, Mr. Jason, that you've been an existing customer, so you actually do actually actually qualify for even a greater discount. Okay, so as I do have it that you're, that you're going to pay £89 for one year, yeah? Am I? It's going to be £89 for one year. Oh, is it? Eighty-nine, eighty-nine. Oh, that seems a terrible amount of money. But had my colleague, I mean, explain to you all of this? Uh, he he did say something, yes. Yeah. So yes, he's rabbiting on <laughs> nineteen to the dozen. Yeah, so it's going to be eighty-nine pounds for one year cover on your washing machine. Okay. Oh. Uh, there's eighty-nine pounds on my washing machine. Exactly. I don't think there is. Or the insurance on your washing machine for one year. Uh, 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 there's there's a, the, uh, a bottle of detergent on there. I don't think there's eighty nine pounds. I'm sorry. No. Yeah, can you hear me? Yeah. Yes, I can hear you. Yes. Okay. So as I said, when it comes to your cover for today, it's going to be a thirty percent discounted rate. It's going to be only eighty nine pounds, giving you one year cover. Okay. Is it? Okay. Are you happy to proceed with this cover, sir? Uh. Uh, I, I I don't think I want to. Sorry? I don't think I want it. Because you just spoke to my colleague just earlier, okay? I did, so yes. Cover for the one year, it's a 30% discounted rate for you, so that your washing machine will be fully covered for the next 12 months. Yeah, I don't want so that. you believe that you fully understand and agree to this? I, I didn't agree to it, no. You didn't agree to it? No. Okay, I'll get one of my colleagues to call you back then, just to give you more information about your cover. Okay. I don't want it. Thank you very much for your time, Dan. I'll get my colleagues to call you back. Telephone number 0127397 Hello. Hello. Uh, I'm this is Chris. How are you doing? Uh, I, I'm all right, thank you. Lovely. Do you remember me? Uh, so, sorry? Do you remember me? I uh, spoke to you around uh, three or four days ago. Oh, yes. Yes, that's right, in yes. Regards to your, in regards to your washing machine, do you remember? Oh, yes. Yes, that's right. Yes, yeah. I do remember now. And yeah, and uh, I, at that time I was telling you, like as you gave me the card number, your Lloyds Bank card number ending with 2519, and I was telling you that you are going to receive a call from our verification team. Uh. So as I can see in my system, uh, my verification team said that you did not agree to take the cover, right? Hmm, yes. But 
fine, sir. Why is it so? Because I told you that we will be covering your washing machine for the next one year for the 89 pounds. And you gave me your car details also. So what, what happened? Like you changed your mind? Well, I didn't make up my mind in the first place, I don't suppose. But you know, I, I, I you know, I, I suddenly remembered when I was talking to your verification team that uh, I, I told you that it was a white washing machine, uh, and uh, that's not actually right. Uh, so, Mister, you can you tell me, like, what do you want me to do? Like, should I go ahead and put you under the cover by your authorization? Well, well, I mean, the problem is uh, that would be really me operating under, under the, you know, incorrect. Inf I'd have given you inf incorrect information because I, I told you it was a white washing machine, and uh, when, when when I went back when I went back into the uh, kitchen the kitchen, I, I I suddenly remembered when, when I looked at it that it's not, uh, it, it's a rather best spoke uh, special special model. Uh, that, uh, it's a. Uh, it's uh, uh, so you know, it, it's uh, twenty twenty two karat gold with uh, diamante uh, detailing. It, it was a, uh, it was a. Uh, I won it in a raffle at the village fete. Uh, 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 you know, um, I, I think it was uh, donated by um, the um, ex-wife of a, a rock star who, who we have in the village here. Uh, and uh, you know it, it's a bit ostentatious. It, it's a bit of a monster, but uh, you know it, it was for the, for the, you know, for the raising money for the ch for the church, 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 church tower. So so I, I really couldn't uh, t t turn it down, and uh, so they installed this uh, well, it's a monstrosity really in in my kitchen, uh, and. Uh, uh, you know, yeah. I mean, uh, Benji likes it. He likes watching the uh, clothes going around in it and the uh, where it catches the light. But uh, you know, uh, if I, if I if we went ahead with me telling you it was a white white washing machine, that would be quite quite incorrect. All right. So you said like twenty two gold. You are saying like your washing machine is made of gold. Uh, well, it's plated with gold. You know, it belonged to this rock star, Brian Eno. It was a, it's a ridic ridiculous, a ridiculous thing the, 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 these rock stars get up to. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much. You have a good day. Thank you so much for your time. Well, you're very welcome. Thank you. Thank you.